Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for clicking on today's video. Uh, today is going to be a really different video. I'm actually beginning filming at 1040 p.m. And uh, I will explain that after the intro. I just want to thank all of you, um, all the new followers. I am so excited you're here. Uh, I love all my followers, the ones that have been here uh, since the beginning and, and anyone who has come along the way. Thank you. Thank you so much. And if you are new today, uh, the warmest welcome to you as well. And I hope by the end of this video, you will consider subscribing to my channel and hitting that notification bell. All right, you guys, come see why I am here at 1040 at night. This is why I decided to start this video so late at night, and it is 1045 p.m. So um, there's a couple different reasons why. And the first one is I tried a new complexion uh, regimen today or a combination. And I want you to understand when I get ready for work, I wake up at 540 in the morning. And the time I'm done, you know, applying all my makeup, it's around 640 uh, in the morning. So I went to work and I work in a dental office and I wear a mask all day long. So it is now 1040 at night. I've done zero touch-ups on purpose just to see how this, you know, was going to work out. And this is where we're at right now. And I honestly, I mean, it's not flawless by any means. Um, I'm looking and, you know, I got a little bit of wear through here. Um, I have peeling going on here, so we just got to ignore that. Any product is going to look horrible right there. Um, again, I had a facial and it's really starting to do its magic right now. But I mean, if you look here, everything looks, I mean, not bad. You guys, this is a lot of hours, a lot of hours with a mask on all day. So that's going to be an upcoming video of what I did here. So that's why I kind of wanted to start here. But the real reason why we're here today is I have changed, um, a few things in my nighttime regimen. Anytime I do change anything in my skincare, um, I'm going to share that with you. Um, so there's no secrets between us with my skincare or anything. If I ever get a procedure, you're going to know. I have eliminated a beloved product of mine and I'm so sad. Um, hopefully things will change and I can bring them back. So I'm taking away a product and I've added two. <laughs> so the product I'm eliminating, you guys, is this is my my beloved CeraVe PM. You know how long I've used this. I've been using this ever since I've started my channel prior to that even. Um, but I learned something new about this and I'm just so sad. And um, I ran across an article. I also had seen something on YouTube here and I'll post that video down there. Funny thing is, you guys, I am like, this is the, <laughs> the last of it, right? You know, I'm almost out. And so after this, I'm not repurchasing this. And I'm going to tell you why. Um, what has happened is a lot of people were starting to get breakouts. They were starting to um, get skin irritation. They were getting red, um, like burning sensation. And they couldn't understand why, what was going on. I mean, it's really hard when you use several different skincare products to pinpoint what is causing this problem. And, you know, you could think it's your foundation, your power, something, you know, setting spray. So people started looking into things, uh, you know, pretty closely. And what they have come to is that we found out, well, not we, but they have found out that they changed the formula of this. And I will put a side-by-side -side of the ingredients uh, right here so you can see they are quite different. And what they have done is, th and the reason why people aren't really noticing to now, because they changed this formula in 2000. So, you know, for a long time, a lot of stock, you know, the stores had tons of stock of this. Um, or, and then again, people just didn't know what it was that was irritating. So it was a combination of... The old formula still being on the shelves and then people purchasing it and taking some time to realize what was causing their problem. So they have taken out the parabens, which that is what the you know consumer wanted. They wanted them to take it out, so they did. And then they also eliminated um, hyaluronic acid. 
and they replaced it with sodium hyaluronate, which is, it's good for the skin, but it absorbs differently. So hyaluronic acid, you know that, you know, it just absorbs super quick. Um, and the um, sodium hyaluronate, it absorbs deep, I mean, deep into the pores, which, I mean, it can be good for your skin, you know, it can be, but if you're not used to it, that's what's causing some irritation, but that's not the only thing <laughs> that is causing it. Um, when they eliminated the parabens, they replaced it with the preservative Phoenix Xylenol. Now, the Phoenix Xylenol is, um, it's just very, very drying. You know, it can be very irritating to the skin. They also put it in perfumes. People just get a really bad irritation to that. And that's what was causing the problem. Now, I was not, you know, willing to take the risk and purchase, you know, the new formula and be totally irritated for my son's wedding coming up. Yeah, you know how in, very important that is to me. So I do not want anything irritating my skin. This is already a major problem that better go away uh, by the 29th of this month. So um, yeah, I had gotten a facial. I'm really starting to peel. What I've replaced this with is this here. And this is Pareto Centella Unscented Recovery Cream. I had seen some reviews here on YouTube, of, gosh, months ago. And I thought, wow, that's a nice, you know, cream. But I was always afraid to just switch up my products. You know, I why fix something that's not broken? <laughs> and, well, it's broken, so we need to fix it. <laughs> and the the reason why I was hesitant is because I I know you can probably get it way cheaper. And yes, I I believe that's who sells Pareto. But you guys, I am very very impatient with my. When I want something, I want it now. And you know how long, yes, um, their delivery is. So um, I ordered it off Amazon. That's a risk to take too because, you know, there's some people that really have had bad luck. I've had actually very good luck with their makeup and sunscreens, everything. You know, I've just had very good luck. Just always check the expiration dates, you guys. And then if it's bad, send it back. I never buy anything unless it's returnable. Um, now the problem is... This here is, let me get my glasses, um, this here is three fluid ounces, and I think I paid like $13 for this, and this, the Pareto, is only, oh gosh, uh, 1.7 fluid ounces, so like almost half of what you get in here. Now, I have used this a couple nights, and I do find that I use a little less than this but not much and this is this was $16 on Amazon so um, I'm using it for now but I just wanted to let you guys know I am you know switching things up the great thing is this has a lot of nice ingredients in it I was reading up on it and I'll just read a little bit of it um, it has centella asiatica extract in it and what it is best known for is wound healing abilities so uh, it's, it's, it says it's so-called tiger grass from the legend that tigers would roll around in this grass to heal their wounds. So I thought that was really neat. So, um, you know, if you even have like a lot of irritation on your face, you know, supposedly this will help. Um, it also has a uh, ceramide NP, which is a mild and green ingredient that does not cause skin irritation due to its structure similar to skin lipid. It strengthens the skin barrier uh, to fight off exter external stimuli, uh, keeps the skin hydrated by sealing and moisturizer, preventing evaporation of skin moisture, and maintaining the healthy balance of oil and water. And it also has a squalling in it. So I'm super excited. Uh, like I said, I've tried it for about two nights in a row. And I really liked how my skin felt. Uh, there was no ir irritation. Um, it felt very hydrated. Um, so uh, and that was the other thing with this. People were starting to see that they were using double the amount uh, because it just wasn't giving that beautiful moisture like I have on my hand now. Uh, it was almost drying them out. So I've given up that and I have brought this in. Now I do have another thing that I'm doing at night and what I'm going to do now is finally go take off this makeup that's been sitting on my face all day. And I'm going to show you what I have added. So I'll be right back. Okay, I've removed all my makeup. And now I am going to go through my complete nighttime skincare routine. Uh, for those of you who have already seen this, you can kind of fast forward ahead. 
uh, to get to the part of the last step that I have added. Okay, so I do remove my uh, makeup with this. Here's my um, Good Molecules. It's our instant cleansing balm. And it comes like in a new tin. Before it used to come like in a plastic container. And now this is tin, which is cool because you can kind of reuse it when you're done. Oops. <laughs> and it comes with whoop, a little scoop. And that's what it looks like in here. So, yeah, I'm running low. I'm going to need another one really soon but it just melts your makeup off i absolutely love it elf also carries um like a balm like this that i really like as well so i heard they're going to be selling this at ulta i haven't seen it at mine yet um but when they do that will be super awesome it'll come in handy being close and i don't have to wait like you know how i hate to wait <laughs> now the other thing i am using because i double cleanse is this after now i have heard rumor there is something flying around my room. Oh my God. Okay, excellent. Okay, let's try this again. I have heard rumor that they have changed all of their formulas. Uh, I hope that's not so because I love this as my, um, you know, for my double cleansing. So I will double check into the ingredients on this and let you know if anything changes on that. Okay, so I've already double cleansed. And then what I go into, well, first, now I am going to go into trying to get some of this dead skin off. And I just use a twinkle razor, you guys. And this really does help. You just go over very lightly uh, where you do have um, some dry skin. Okay, so once I've <laughs> removed uh, some of that, done, that dead skin, uh, I go in and I do... Uh, dampen my face with some water and I just have a little bit of water here in a spray bottle uh, You can get these on Amazon. I'll put that in the a description box below and I'll have all the products down there and then I go in No, I'm lying. I go in with my uh, by the ordinary the niaminicide and this one is in 10% uh, and then zinc at 1% so I just use very little of this on my nose um, because my Curology also has niaminicide, but uh, there's just some places I like to add just a little extra. So I'm going to just put that over here and a little bit on this breakout I have going on. See, when I get my, my facials, I get peeling and my skin does purge. Okay, you guys, and honestly, tonight I am not going to use my Cur Curology because I am peeling so much and... I don't want to cause any more irritation to my skin uh, because this has my uh, tretinoin in it and uh, my formula is zero, um, 0 0.035, has the azelaic acid in it uh, at 5% and then I am minicide at 4%. So I'm not going to apply this today, you guys, only because I'm trying to get rid of some of this peeling. But otherwise, it would go that little bit of niaminicide, then this. Then now I'm going to go into, I'm actually going to spray my face because it is super dry right now. I'm going to go in with my uh, Matrixyl Sin 6 Serum, and this is a peptide here. Um, this is wonderful. And I just go in, and this is supposed to reverse um, time a little bit. It helps with fine lines, wrinkles. Uh, it has hyaluronic acid in it. And yeah, it is just so soothing. And I just take that all over, rub it down my neck, and go under my eyes, and just put that all over the skin. Now there is a little um, stickiness to it, just so you know. Then I go in with the, uh, this is by Good Molecules. This one is the Super Peptide Serum. This is formulated with tripeptides, and this targets fine lines, wrinkles as well, um, and also dullness of the skin. And then I just go in and put that all over the face. At nighttime, I do get my eyelids. Uh, during the day, um, like I told you in the one video, I do not, only because it does interfere with my makeup. And with hooded eyes, I don't want to cause anything that's going to add to <laughs> more creasing. Oh, and again, I go down my neck, starting to feel better now. <laughs> but I got, finally got that makeup off. Now I'm going to go in with this product, and this is new to my skincare as well. It's through Timeless, and it's their hydrating eye cream. And this has hyaluronic acid, 
the Matrixel um, 3000. This has great skin loving properties as well. Again, I just put that all over my eye. And I just go in a nice circular motion. And then I go in with this new uh, Perito. And I'll show you what that looks like. Put a little bit on my hand just so you can see. So it's yeah, just a very nice thin hydrating lotion. So I'm just going to put about that much on. That's all you really need. Especially after all these skincare products. And I just go in and put that all over. On my lips, I just put on this cob. I just absolutely love this oil. So hydrating to my lips. Uh, those get pretty dry at night as well. So that is about it. Um, I'm just going to put a little bit more of this oil on. And then here comes what I have added. And ideally, you'd want this to dry down for about five minutes. So actually, I'm going to, otherwise, it's just not going to work. So again, I'm going to go off. I'm going to wait about five minutes, and I'll be right back. Okay, so I have let all my products really dry down and absorb into my skin. Okay, so what I have added as well are these frowny um, facial patches. And I did purchase mine on Amazon. And I've been using them, you guys, for... A few weeks and I am I am seeing a difference I I know I am I'm not crazy I've really seen a difference I had a really deep line here I mean it's still there but I can see that it is shrinking um, so as you can see I've used quite a bit there's 144 patches in here and I only have this left and <laughs> this love so i am in i mean, do need to place another order because i really do like them and i use six every night and they're all you know it's like a perforated uh type thing here and you just remove that and there is two strips per square so as you can see in here there's two and so you just make sure you know you want to really um, cause they will, it will rip if you do it the wrong way. And then they have like this thing going on here. I don't know what that's about. So I try to keep those on. Sometimes they rip off when I'm taking them apart, but I like that little pointy part. As you can see, I got my six little strips here. And as you can see, one side is shiny and the other side is dull. Uh, you're going to want to put the shiny part, uh, against your skin. And how I apply mine is I take my water again and I just spray my forehead or wherever you're going to place it and or you can, you know, spray this directly. Um, I find it easier to go do this and then I put, oop, I almost put it on backwards and I put one, you know, in my 11s and I put that here and then I take... Um, another one and put it off to the side like that and it's okay if these aren't sticking down all the way right now I'm um, just kind of doing placement and if you you know start drying down a little bit just add a little bit more water um, and then I take this one and I put it here so I'm, it's like a puzzle <laughs> a puzzle on your face and you're gonna look crazy and um, you know, if someone lives with you, you know, married or whatnot, boyfriend, fiance, they're going to think you are nuts, but it is so worth it. I'm telling you, I am seeing a difference and I'm actually going to come back tomorrow morning, um, you know, and film showing you what it looks like when I, you know, remove it. So, um, yeah. And then if you feel like it's coming off here, you can just add a little bit of water to your finger, you know, and add that, um, and just anywhere where you feel like it needs to be sitting down a little better. And then just kind of hold it there for a minute <laughs> until it's really stuck on your head. Okay, so then, and I also put some on over here. So I'm just going to spray that a little bit. And you, know, you can even add a little bit of the water to the product itself. And... I just go in and let that sit there for a second. And what these do, you guys, is it prevents you through the night 
of um like i can hardly move my forehead right now um and that's what it's doing because my husband even told me for years he goes you look so mad at night he goes you must be having a horrible dream about me because i would do that look um which i do a lot through the day anyway that's why my uh, 11s are probably so nice and prominent because i'm always you know with that face or squinting when i can't see um so that's what it's doing it's kind of like a botox uh, <laughs> through the night so yeah again you look insane um but it does help i'm telling you you will see a huge difference tomorrow now the difference that you will see doesn't last, you know, all through the day as prominent um, as when you first take it off. But again, I'm seeing results through time. Um, my wrinkles are not as bad on my forehead. So again, yeah, that's about, that's about it. <laughs> what I can do. So um, yeah, you can, they have some for your face around here. Um, I tried that one night, you guys. It's hard to get used to. I mean, this alone has been hard to get used to. So um, maybe through time, I will add uh, some through here. Yeah, that's what I uh, have eliminated and what I have brought in. And yeah, I will be back tomorrow morning again, you know, to show you the results. Uh, again, you guys, everybody, I am so excited um, that you are all here. And yeah, I'm super, super excited to get to know each and every one of you. Um, my followers that I had before, you know how much I adore you. I love our conversations. Um, yeah, I have some met some really dear friends on here. So yeah, I am super excited. And yes, let's all be friends, get to know each other. And I'm going to go to bed and good night to you guys. And I'll be back in the morning. Good morning, guys. Yes, it is about 7.30 in the morning now. Um, I'm an early riser, and I'm about to remove these because I want them off. <laughs> Ideally, you would want to be in front of the sink and, you know, really soak these down. But I'm, right now, I'm just going to use um, my little wash rag and dampen them and remove them, and we'll see the difference. So this is what my forehead looks now. I will put a side-by-side -side picture from last night to today. I actually really love these. I honestly think they're doing something, um, especially my 11s. Uh, they, like I said, I had a really deep um, line here, uh, especially in the morning. I love it because it looks completely smooth. Um, now, throughout the day, it will start returning, but again, it's not returning as bad as before I started using these. Again, anything I change in my skincare, you will be well aware of, I promise. And I'm always super excited to share anything that I do try that's new with you guys, and I hope you, you know, got some information today that was informative for you, um, so I, you know, some ideas for your skincare. And yeah, if you have any questions, honestly, uh, ask me in the comments below. I will, if I don't know the answer, I will certainly try to research it and provide that for you. If you did like today's video, if you'd please give it a thumbs up. I truly appreciate it and it does help my channel. All right, you guys, until next time.